Hello third graders, happy first day of school. I am currently on school G and I'm going to walk you through how to do a couple things today. First thing you're going to do is you're going to want to get into our course, which is this one right here, the one where it says welcome to third grade with Miss Kendra. Please click on that. All right, and you should be looking at this if you are in a web browser, if you are in the app, of school G it'll look like this both options are completely fine it's preference or it's whatever you would like to do if you want to use the app or the Safari version I personally like the Safari version so I'm going to help you first today create a button that you can easily access school G on Safari so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to come up here to this little up arrow. You're going to click on that. Then we're going to scroll down and click on add to home screen. And we can just click this add button here. Now I can see that this app has been created on my home screen. This is an app that I know I'm going to use regularly. So I want to move it to my toolbar down here. This is going to be apps that I have pinned that I know I will use often. Over here are apps that have been opened recently. You cannot change those ones, it's just based on what you open. These you can change though. So I'm going to hold down that app right there and I'm going to say edit home screen. Now I can drag this to my bar right here and it's going to be pinned so I can easily open that. I would recommend you also have Dojo, Notability, and another good one that I would like you guys to add that I might not have on my iPad yet is the IXL app. If you have that, that is a great app to pin to our toolbar right here because we will be using that often. I'm going to hit my home button. That will stop them from wiggling. Now I'm gonna go back to this button here. So I have School G opened. And we are going to scroll down. The first day of school is Tuesday, so I'm just gonna click on Tuesday. For every day of the week, you're going to come in and you are going to click on the day of the week that it is. So Tuesday. You will not see all of these folders. You will just see the one for the week that, that it is. So I'll click on that. And then here is the list of items that you are to complete for Tuesday. So right here I say please read me first. And then number one is all about our year together and all about Miss Kendra. Step number two, that is where you should be right now. Video walkthrough, button making, and notability. This is what you should be on right now. That is this video that I'm currently creating. And then you can follow the rest of the assignments throughout the day and I will be adding most likely some more to Tuesday. So the next thing we are going to do is I'm going to walk you through how to use notability. So you are going to click on Miss Kendra, true or false. And I have this assignment here. So again, School G is where most of your assignments will be posted. When you use School G, there's going to be assignments posted on there that you have to write on. In order to do that, we have to put that piece of paper into another app that you can write on and then you can upload it back into Schoology. So this first one here, I would click on my PDF. It's going to pop up like this and I cannot write on this yet. It does not allow me to write on here. So I need to put this into a different app that I can then write on. That app is called Notability. So I'm gonna go up here again to this little arrow and I'm going to scroll over. Notability is right here. If you don't see it, you can keep scrolling and you can hit this more button to find more apps. So I'm going to click Notability. This is going to ask me if I want to send it to Notability, and yes I do. I'm going to add it to uh, my No August 26, 2020. And I can title it differently if I want. Oh, maybe I had to do it back there. Well, Maybe not. So I can import this into Notability, and it says one file has been sent. So I'm going to come back to my regular Schoology login, 
just so I'm ready for when I'm done. And now to get back to that file, I have to hit my home button to see my home screen. I have to come to Notability. It's right here, so it's very easy for me to click on. And my file, oh, that was me kind of testing things out. <laughs> my file will be right up here, true or false. And now I have the option to, I can draw, I can type, I can highlight, and I can do many things with this program. So I'm going to go through and answer true or false about Miss Kendra. Some of these, the answers were in the slideshow, some of them were not. So you can just take your best guess and then they, there will be an answer key when you're done. So I'm going to zoom in, take my fingers to pinch so I can draw a little better. Number one, I played tennis in high school. I'm going to come up here to this little pencil, click on that. It's a little thick right now, and I want it to be thinner so I can read it easier. So I'm going to come to this one and click on that circle. And most of the time we are writing in black, so it's easier for us to see. So I play tennis in high school. I think that's true, so I'm going to write a T right here. Number two, I only have a pet dog named Toby. So I'll come to number two, and this time I think I want to type it. So I'm going to hit my T up here, and then I'm going to tap where I want to type. Move it up there, and then I can type, let's say this one I think is false. So I can put my F right there, and I can make my text box a little smaller so I can easily move that F to where I want it. And then I'll move on to my next question. When you are all done, this is when we have to submit this assignment back to school G. All right, so to do that, we're going to come to this up arrow again. And I'm going to go to other apps down here. Share note. And now I need to find school G. This time I'm going to do it into the school G app. So I'm going to click that S right there. For me, I don't have the same courses that you are seeing right now, but what everybody should see is submit to assignment. So I'll click that. And then you should see my third grade course. So it should say this right up here, third grade, third slash 03 dash third. You're going to click on that. And then that will allow you to select the correct day and assignment to turn that back into. So you should be turning it back into Miss Kendra True False. You need to go into your Tuesday folder and find that assignment to turn that in there. I can't show you on here because I don't have that same course, but that is the furthest I can show you on my end. When you're done, you can close out of that and you can go back into your assignment to verify that you have turned it in. I would click on Miss Kendra true or false and it would tell me as the student that I have turned this in. And then on my end, I can see submissions for these assignments. Nobody has submitted this yet because we have not had our first day of school yet. That is where you will be going to turn in assignments using Notability. I hope this video helps. Please reach out to me, parents and students, if you have any questions on how to download files to Notability and then complete that assignment and then turn it back in to Schoology. I'd be so, so happy to help you all. Again, happy first day of school and I will talk to you all soon.